Hey guys, what's up? What's going on? Hopefully you can't hear the shower, because I can't. Please excuse my wangs. I was trying to fly this morning. Um, I wanted to do a first impression of a pretty trending thing, at least on my Facebook. It has been this handheld embroidery pin. So this is how it came. I don't know if you recognize the pin. Um, on the back of the package it shows you some... What glare? 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 There. Shows you some embroidery options. I saw this on Facebook and I must have been having a day because I just impulsively bought it. <laughs> I don't normally do that with those weird Facebook ads, you know, that are sponsored or promoted and 10 hours left to order, like that thing. But for some reason, I was just like, I want to see if this works. And it was like, I think I spent a total of like 15 to $17 on this. It was $10 plus shipping, so the shipping was like 6 or $7. The inside of this little uh, pamphlet thingy, our instructions, shows you how to punch, um, holding the needle, threading the needle, um, how to do it properly, not mess up, and then how to exchange the needle because there's three different needles and uh, gives you a few examples. Ironically enough, I was about to uh, you doorbell. Okay, back, I'm back. This is not really embroidery, a little bit of it is, but I did a little felt frame several years ago of uh, Jake from Adventure Time making bacon pancakes. And the only thing that's really embroidered, I guess, would be the words and then the sizzle. The rest of it I just stitched on. So I'm gonna use this frame today and we're gonna just see if this embroidery pin works because if it does, I'm gonna be so excited. Well, I've got just some really, really thin, cheap fabric. I don't remember what this is called. It's like the, like, what you practice patterns in but you never use it as real fabric. So I'm just gonna place it in this, um, what are these called? Embroidery frames? Okay, so let's follow the instructions here. Holding the needle. Like this. Great. We used a right-handed person. That's leftist. Hold the punch needle and script face the needle front. The bevel, that's this part. Um, actually, it's this part, this pointy. You can, can you see it's ang angled? Okay, so that's how you hold it. So you thread the needle using the threader, which it comes with. It's these. So, you insert the threader into the punch needle from the needle point and complete through its barrel until it comes out the opposite end. Get this teeny tiny threader, thread it through the... I feel like this needle is huge. We'll find out. Go all the way through. <gasps> wow! Insert thread or yarn. Yarn? I didn't know you could do yarn. I mean, I guess that's what this looks like. Through the threader loop and pull the threader back out of the needle. Okay, so I'm gonna do blue. Wait, have I ever opened this? Nope, I'm gonna do pink. Put it through the threader. Okay. And remove this from the threader. Ooh, insert the threader through the needle eye from the needle back of the Needle tip. Needle. <laughs> okay. So I just threaded it through the little point, the hole, and leaning it through. Punch needle should penetrate all the way into the fabric so the grip of the needle touches the fabric. This doesn't explain what these numbers are for. <laughs> Let, let us, let us practice. Okay, let's just find out what happens. This needle is too big. Remove the cap, loosen the screw, and take the needle out. Super difficult. <laughs> oh, okay. How do I? Tansy, help me. You know the language of your people. Oh, I got it. Thank you. I see. So this, the numbers on here are the dis. It's like the distance from the. But that's weird. Like, why would you want it any lower or high away, further away from? I don't. Know. Oh, to make it fluffy. Okay, I get it. I'm getting it. Okay, put the cat back on. Let's try it again. How are you supposed to thread it if it won't fit? 
Okay, so I'm trying yarn this time, which it might be too thick, but at this point, nothing's working, so <laughs> I guess it doesn't really matter. Oh. Nope, that, oh, that's not working. Get a Ghost Rider. Do we have any other yarn? Do I have thinner yarn? Oh, I do. Okay, let's try a thinner yarn. Where is it at? It's in Chile, right? Oh, it's in, oh, okay. <gasps> no. No! I broke it. I'm breaking it. I'm breaking it. Not an option. Okay. Not so sure about this one, but we'll find out. I can't even thread this yarn. Said I can't even thread this yarn. Okay, it's a bust. We're gonna call this a uh, fail. Well, A for effort? Nah, I don't even think it's A for effort. Well, hopefully I can return it, cause it's a piece of poop. Thanks for watching, this has been a productive video. Glad I could do it, I could waste my time. Just kidding, it would've been cool if it worked, but oh well, all right. Tune in next time for my first impression. Just keep on watching.